Hi guys, Pink here. This is episode 59 of Let's Learn a Geod Civil War II. We are in early December 1862. We had just done the movement and we're ready for the production and the decisions. Looks like winter has definitely set in in the east. And basically in all theaters. It's not very harsh, just harsh. Okay, but it's time to do production. I want to get some artillery for this army and for Fremont's army. Now, I was thinking Fremont is just farting around down here in this army's um, area of operation here. So I'm going to take Fremont over here and bring him down and, and get this army put together and uh, look at moving, moving on Little Rock. So, we need to get some artillery for the West. Missouri. I think that's only six pounders, yeah. So, let's build one. Two. there and can I make Kentucky artillery in Bowling Green hey what are you doing hmm I'll put them a little farther back. All right. And I wanted to get some. Hmm. Well, I apparently, I'll put this on all and this on this. There we go. Supply. I can't get any supply units now. <laughs> well, I wonder if I can raise money. Not yet. I could increase the rail pool. We'll do that. Um, that's kind of it for money. What can we do here? Oh, we wanted to do the counter intel again because these failed. So we need that there and here. All right. I think that's it for those. Let's come back over here to the theater that things are going on. What did I do? I had just done my movement. That's what it was. Okay, I was thinking I hadn't moved these guys yet, but I have. Okay, so we'll save the turn here and we will run it. All right. See anything interesting? I see none of these units activated. Not a one of them of the cores of the army. Johnston showed up in Richmond. I don't think this blockade is needed anymore because I think I'm blockading Richmond with my army here. I need to move those boats to somewhere else. I've been doing the blockade very poorly. I've been handling my navy very poorly in general. What is this guy doing? Is he going to go... Oh. Butler. Fire! This was that assault on... Uh, the Battle of Petersburg. On an assault. And we wiped these guys out. Who was this guy? Hoke. Oh. 
All right. Starts with a good thing. Oh, all oh, these, uh, that was those, uh, copperheads, I think, he formed in there, and I just got, just promptly stomped them. I think he might be heading for Norfolk. This was a fairly powerful force. I think Butler's going to have to fall back to defend Norfolk, because that's a, a victory city. Is that Jackson? That was Jackson. Yeah, right there. What is this? Somebody that went out and got sunk. Gunboat squadron. Yeah. All right, so well, you sunk. Oh, these guys are really falling back now. What are these guys doing? Did he fall back? Yeah, he's fallen back. The Culpepper, which means he is no longer entrenched. Oh, looks like the weather broke a bit. Or it's probably just mud. No, it's nice weather there. Okay, we got some trained soldiers. Well, let's get to the scripted. We sold some. More runs. We may print paper money again, and we lost some rail capacity. We made a breach in the Richmond fortifications, a total of five, did six hits. We failed to engage the enemy Norfolk supplies in Nelson, Virginia. Magruder has just kind of popped out that way. It's a good thing I moved this, uh, this core down here. And Petersburg gained us some stuff. Pleasanton engaged in Granville. Oh, he... Okay. We succeeded in retreating before Culpepper. Oh, this guy was here, and he fell back in front of this guy. Now, we've got a... He may, he may, uh, there was no depot here, but he may have captured some supplies here, and there's certainly a bunch of supplies in uh, Manassas, so we've got to definitely hold that. All right. And we sunk the ships in the James Estuary, and we failed to engage them in Spotsylvania. Oh, right here. They're trying to get supplies to this guy. Dix reverted to a defensive stance. Franklin reverted to a defensive stance. A lot of guys suffering hits from wear and tear, and that's from uh, the winter weather. Um, successfully trained, successfully trained. Various garrisons getting trained. All right. We t oh, there was a nice little chunk of supplies captured in Petersburg there. And the, we've got... Oh, nice, uh, nice batch of uh, industry there too. Counterintelligence was unsuccessful, but it was successful in Carroll. New, numerous demonstrations in here, yeah. Barry has been congratulated. Geary has been congratulated. Hunter. Buford, 
Lion Force has been moved to welcome Arkansas. Well, why in the hell did that happen? I didn't want to go there. Maybe because his cohesion is so low. Oh, it's because it's the very harsh weather here. Blizzards. So they moved him over here. We definitely got to get these guys back under cover. Or let them recover, so... Okay, so looks like we are ready to do some movements. Let's see. Army of the Shenandoah under Johnston is here. Lee's Corps is still here. Now this, if I recall, was a, a big, good-sized force, and they're going to come back and grab our supply base. Now we could actually, I mean, we don't want to lose that, obviously, but we could actually um, take City Point here, and it has a um, harbor, and we could put a, uh, put a depot there. But I think, I think, I think, I think, I think I need to move... Barry's core back to Norfolk because I think we're getting ready to get our supply base taken away from us. By rail. I think so. And then we'll put this guy up here. Or what is this? This is a depot here, too. We don't want to lose this, either. Why don't we take... Hmm. I need to get my forces arranged better. I don't need all of these guys farting around in the, in the mountains here. I need to get something down here. Now, this core here, ideally would be moving into uh, Butler's army, but I've got to have him fall back and protect Manassas. Can I railroad him? Yeah, get him there. Underneath there is the pack trains. How are you doing? Um, let's give you this pack train. What do we have here? Um, our, our supply looks pretty good. Oh, he lost a bunch of his cohesion I'm trying to move into here, I guess, in the poor weather. Hmm. Just let them finish moving, I guess. Put this guy on assault. See if we can take Charlotte. There's a depot there. Do we have anything here? Nothing. Oh, a bunch of other uh, leaders? No, this is the same batch of leaders we had before. We get some more... What do you got here? Why don't we send these three to him and he will form a division with those. I think that's what I'm going to do with them. Now, I don't think this force is really anything. There's two divisions here, but I don't think there's much left. Hmm. What 
just have to see. Everybody here gets put on offensive. One of them might actually end up being on offensive. You never know. All right. Down here. What is all of this? Oh, he is... We've got pack trains. Oh, this one is going to Lincoln, Tennessee. That's here. Okay. And this one's going back to Nashville. And this guy here is repairing the railroad. Pack trains should be on passive. He should have been fixing the railroad while he was here. Bring this guy down. I think that'll work. He's still kitting across the river. I should probably get Pope on the same side of the river here. We'll just start coming down. He's heading back that way. Halleck. Halleck, the Army of the Cumberland. I think that looks good. What's our... Put him on. Hmm. Let's go take New Madrid. It's in the swamp, pouring rain in the winter. Yeah, let's maybe not. We'll just sit tight. Okay. What is this going to be? Do we have any cavalry? We need cavalry over here, too. Somebody's mismanaged this army. All right. Artillery being formed here. This will be... I don't really know if I actually need all of that force for this guy now, though. Alright, he's going to fall back to Fayetteville. we still got plenty of supply here, so we'll just sit tight down here. Hmm. I guess we're just going to sit here and stare at each other. That's probably what we're going to do. All right. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know what to do over here anymore. I don't really want to go into the into the wastes there. We can send I know what we can do. We can send Carson's force up to take on the Indians. Maybe take some of these forts on the way. Maybe. That could work. All right, now let's go through line by line here. Asbeth is just going to stay put. They'll stay put. They'll stay put. Pope is going to sit tight. This is still going to be recovering here. Um, leave him on attack. McLaren is back. We'll go send him to the army for reassignment. Those crayons will just sit tight. Hmm. There's some cavalry that is not being used. Why don't we? 
Why don't we railroad these cavalry to here? We'll use them over there. Waiting through the winter. Carney. What is Carney doing? Well, we are going to. We've got to get on the same side of the river. Or we can come in behind him. Hmm. But his supply situ oh his supply situation is getting a little critical. He's gonna actually have to fall back to here. Or maybe let's have him fall back all the way to there. Can I railroad him at all? Nope. And then we'll come down. Actually he doesn't need to fall back that far. Let's just go to here. Get our supply situation straightened out, and then these two cores will be here, and then we'll come in on on uh, on uh, Bragg there. All right, he's repairing the railroad. These guys. I'll go over there. How about? Buell will just sit tight. Pleasanton. <laughs> Bring them over to Suffolk. Whipple. Hmm. Sumner, just hold that. Wait, what do we have here? An empty supply cart. Send it back to there by rail. Do we have any that are... Alright, those are already going places. Right. Where are you at? Oh, right here. All by himself, and he's going nowhere. I wonder if I can. No, I think I captured that. We'll just add him to you. All right. He's going to assault Charlottesville here. This guy. I'm going to put him on defend. We don't have any. Um, not much in the defenses here, but McClellan has no troops. Hmm. send sickles up here too so we can have a little bit less command delay or command problems all right just wait for the weather over here i guess That one's still frozen. Still recovering. Oh, I got three ironclads here. One of them who doesn't have a picture. Are we, oh, what, what, what? Oh, did I? Did I, like, buy these? Or did these just come in? I don't know. Where's the rest of our monitors? They're down here. Oops. Uh, get him back 
here. This guy's gonna need to recover. All right, what time is it gonna be? We needed some more, oh, some, uh, we bought our artillery and we needed to buy some uh, supply wagons. Where did I want supply wagons? I think I want, because we're gonna need to be making some depots. One, two, three, Two. Can we buy any more artillery? Indiana horse artillery. We'll give that to that other unit that we're building. All right. Um, where did we want to marshal our martial law, our counter intel? Oh, we don't have enough money. So I guess we won't do that. Um, there's probably time to run a turn here. We'll do it anyway. Oh, I forget to send. Oh, bother. Well, good thing I saved. So I will see if I can recover from this. And at that, we will call this the end of the episode. And I will see you next time.